Bulgaria is one of the poorest countries in the EU, but despite its apparent poverty, its people are exceptionally friendly and is overflowing with amazing nature, tasty cuisine and plenty to see and do. However, beware of these 8 more things not to do in Bulgaria. Know before you go! Number 1. Don't visit Rose Valley without roses. Bulgaria is the biggest producer of rose oil in the world. This is all produced in Rose Valley in Karlovo, so you can imagine the sight and smell. Mm. However, the roses only flower between May and June, and it's not really worth the trip to Karlovo if you're going to miss Rose Valley without any roses. Number 2. Don't go to Sunny Beach. You may have heard of Sunny Beach as a must-visit Bulgarian summer location, and maybe that's the whole problem. It's become known for being a cheap holiday destination with plenty of sun, sand and, well, drunken tourists vomiting in the streets. If you're hoping to meet a member of Geordie Shore, it's probably the place for you. But if not, stay away. Number 3. Don't trust taxi drivers. Pretty much everything in Bulgaria is cheap compared to Western prices. Not surprising as this is one of the poorest countries in the EU. Perhaps due to this, taxi drivers have been known to prey on tourists, charging them extortionate prices on arriving at their destination. So be careful to check the driver's rate before you get in. Number 4. Beware the weight of food. In Bulgaria, you might easily find yourself at a restaurant staring blankly at a menu written in Bulgarian, hoping that what you order will be enough to fill the gaping hole in your appetite. Thankfully, however, it's customary there to display the weight of the dish in the menu. This way you know exactly what to expect. Oh, yeah. Number 5. Don't talk about communism. Yes, Bulgaria has a communist past. No, you shouldn't talk about it. Most of the locals won't have been brought up during the communist regime, but the older ones will have, and there are many mixed opinions about how it has left current day Bulgaria. One of the relics left by the regime is the abandoned Baslaza monument. Well worth a visit, just don't talk about it. Number 6. Do your homework. Bulgaria is not a heavily tourist-ready country. Most of the street signs and markings are in Bulgarian using the Cyrillic alphabet. You're not even going to know how to guess at pronouncing any of the road signs. Come prepared, study some pronunciations, or just install Google Translate to convert text on the fly. Number 7. Don't buy bottled water. Ok, this goes against everything we've always said. It still is a very sensible idea to only drink bottled water whilst abroad, but Bulgaria is known historically for the supposed healing powers of its water, of which there are 225 mineral springs and there is always a fountain nearby. Remember Spartacus? Some believe his power came from being raised on this Thracian elixir. Number 8. Don't limit yourself to Sofia. The capital city of Bulgaria is a vibrant European city, but there is so much more to see and do in this Balkan wonderland than just visit Sofia. Where do you want to know what not to do in next? Comment below!